this school year, I really believe it like no other. In the past, parents uh, have, not, I believe, all, always as a parent, you have major concerns, Amen. you know, for your children yes. when it comes to, you know, academics and social pressures and children we face, like even bullying, yes. Yes. <clears throat> alcohol, drugs, promiscuity, and other threats that go against their, their faith. They, they, go to, they go to church as believers, but as believers, they're going to be attacked. Amen. And, uh, and now I'm gonna, I need to add something else to this besides, I mean, we have enough with drugs and all the other stuff, but we have to add now additional worries of COVID-19. The growing divide that seems to be plaguing every American institution to the point of aggression and even violence is going crazy out there. So we, we as parents and I believe as spiritual guardians uh, can place a hedge. We need to pray for a hedge of protection around our young people, yes. our sons and daughters and grandchildren. Come on. Amen and nieces and nephews and even godchildren. Amen. Amen. I children need uh, not to be helpless. Hello? They should be helpless and they should be victims. Amen. Our children uh, need not to lose their uh, sense of well-being and Amen. resolve. Amen. They need not to be swallowed up in the how can I say, the havoc of life, yes. of the unhealthy social and cultural influences that's out, that's out there. The enemy is trying to kill our children. Yes. Oh, yeah, yes. Not only trying to kill them, but also um, there is, I don't know if, you, if you're aware of it, I'm pretty sure you are, but human trafficking. Yeah. Kids are being picked up from everywhere. Yes. Yeah. I mean, from all social lives. And they're being taken and put, in, and put into extreme situations with you know, prostitution and everything else. It's a growing thing. So our prayers are needed. Everybody say amen. 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 Well, in a special way, we need to ask God today to give us wisdom yeah. and grace for our children to guide our sons and daughters. Amen. Grandson, granddaughter, nieces, nephews. This is perilous times. We're in the end of days. So, now if you're a teacher, or a school administrator, or work in schools, but well, we're gonna pray for you as well. Amen. Because how many of you know the teachers today are afraid to go back? Amen. Well, I'm afraid to go back because you know I don't want to get sick. But you know what? I look at it this way. The Bible is very clear. The Bible says, "What greater gift than a person laying down his life for another?" Amen. So you know what? If you're doing it with the right heart, and you're a believer, and you trust God, and you're a teacher or work at school, you gotta say, Lord, just like you protect me every day when I go out, Amen. just like you protect me when I come to church, Amen. you're gonna protect me when I go to school. That's right. Amen. And no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Amen. Amen. Either you believe that, or you don't. Amen. And we have a lot of people that believe in God, but are still afraid. They're still hiding out. They're still being locked down. And that's not the way it should be. And I got a message about that next week about that, so get ready. Because enough is enough. So, how many of you know our Lord is a supernatural God? 
Amen. And I believe that he will put a ring of protection around our children, around yes. our classrooms, yes. around our churches, Amen. around our homes. Yes. Amen. Amen. And we cannot walk in fear. Amen. So I want you to stretch your hands towards them as we pray for them today. And I wanted to write this prayer out because I know that I don't want to forget anything. But I want you to stretch your hands towards these beautiful children. So Heavenly Father, today in the name of Yeshua, our Messiah, we pray that you will be with our children, whether young or old, toddler or teenager, a first grader or master student yes. that is returning back to school this year. Father, we ask you to protect them as they wait even for the bus at their bus stops. Yes, Lord. When they ride the bus, yes. when they travel by bike or car or walk to school, yes. Yes. Father, keep them safe from yes. dangers, yes. seen and unseen. Yes. Help our school administrators, police, crossing guards, bus drivers yes. to remain attentive, fair, alert, and anointed Amen. Yes. on their job. Lord, give our children favor with their friends, classmates, teachers, and help them to pay close attention in class especially. Father, we ask you to let this be the very best year for them. Yes. 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 A positive school yes. year. Not a negative. Not only uh, in school, but also in, that they will have positive memory, yes. positive academics. That they will have positive times in sports, yes. art, yes. and most of all, friendships. Yes. Father, be with our beloved children, administrators, and teachers, yes. and to comprehend and understand what's going on. Yes. Let them to have reasonable but high expectations of every child. Yes. And Father, we ask you for your support, Father. Yes. Cover them. Yes. And we pray for encouragement. Yes. Father, we lift up every child here to you yes. today. Yes. Help every child to stand tall against the peer pressure of the system, yes. Yes. empowering them to make the right decision yes. Yes. that will be pleasing in your eyes. Yes. Protect, hold close, and surround them with outstanding friendship and positive and supportive influences in this year. Keep those drugs and sexual overtures and gossip and <laughs> gossip mongers and bullies and alcohol out of their sight and reach. Yes, yes. Yes. That they may be better enabled to be properly educated and display the beauty of holiness. Yes. They are your children, Lord. Father, help our children to keep their bodies and hormones in check. Yes. Avoiding sex yes. and improper sexual behavior. Yes. Again, Father, we ask you to protect our children from those bullies and those evil situations and people that mean them harm. Help them, Father, to talk, understand, and work out their problems instead of teasing and arguing and fighting with each other. And Father, in conclusion, Lord, over every thing we know and love and trust, Help us as caregivers. Yes. Help us as parents. Help us as supporters. And even more supportive of our children doing this year, please strengthen our resolve and discernment. Let us know when something is going on. And Father, especially with our children's lives, that we may guide them and defend and support them. Help us to keep them steady, ready, and on track with their assignments, social engagement, yes. homework and studies. Yes. Recharge our brains. Yes. Hello, we need that. Yes. <laughs> all of us need to be recharged. Amen. And our brains and memories to allow us to remember all the teachings and subjects that we took so many years, for so many years, that we could be effective in supporting our children yes. and completing their assignments, yes. practice and homework. In the matter of finance, Father, we call upon you to provide for us financially so we could allow our children to go on field trips 
buy school yearbooks, supplies, clothes, pictures, and again, Father, provide appropriate clothing for the season, school events, or whatever else children may need to truly enhance their education or experience. Heavenly Father, give us true favor on our jobs, our homes, our lives, that we would be able to attend activities, that we could support them in sports and school charities. Yeah. And Father, remind us of the need to pray for our children every single day, yes, Lord. morning, noon, and night. And Father, let prayer start in our home first, and then we can bring it to church. And Father, we pray right now for all of this, and we thank you in advance for your divine protection over them. We plead the blood of Yeshua over every child, and we pray for the angels of the Lord, the warning angels, to encamp around them that no weapon formed against them shall ever prosper. In Yeshua's name, and all God's people say, Amen. 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 Amen.